sexy thoughts. We free waffles! Did I just say that out loud? What? Sorry, just a second. That was what I forgot at the store. I couldn't remember all day. I'm ready now. I don't think you are. Just admit, you're not into sex. It's kind of like you're pornophobic. Try saying something racy. You need to decide. It's me or the porn. I want your hot, throbbing, You're right, love? Just coming to check to make sure everything's fine? What? What? No. No, no, no. I'm, I'm just medicating. Tating. Meditating. Hello. Wait, why do you look so good? I met someone, so I made a sex to do list. Best breakup ever. We don't have to figure it out. Oh, God. Quick question for you Do you do Pilates or. Oh, wow. Do you know what? You really have turned over a new leaf. Get a dance. <laughs> Don't you think he's a little bit out of my league? You're just afraid to get back on the horse. It's like riding a bike. Or maybe a pogo stick. <laughs> it's like one ghost, and you're my Patrick Swayze. OK, tell me everything I need to know about you. Sure you want to know? Yeah, you're right. Could be the end of something good before it even starts. Or it could be the start of something good that doesn't end. That is corny. <laughs> I just want to find out if this works. Actually, sir, I've got it on right now. What do you mean you're wearing it now? Ah, uh, Luce, I don't think you put erection cream on your lips. Hey, stay with me for more on rom-com movies. Now, Pretty Woman was originally much darker, titled 3000, and wasn't a love story, and it didn't have a happy ending. Instead of a rom-com about two very different people finding love, it was a grittier tale about two damaged individuals who spend a week together that ends in tears and zero hope for a balcony set reunion. Mm. Now, click here below to subscribe and tap the bell to always receive the latest trailers.